So this class is going to be the focus less is on structured writing and it's going to cover all kinds of the writing that would encompass it's really more imaginative. And then we sort of move from there, once we kind of have that idea of what creative writing is about down, then we start moving to um, different types, like plays is what we've been working on for a little bit here. A um, little more challenging, but the, the kids like that a lot. Moving into poetry, some, and we kind of weave in there things like grammar and spelling, um, things that make, they just sort of transcend all writing. But it's the main, the main differentiating quality being that the, the subjects are sort of whatever we want. Ooh, I like that. So maybe can we just say that a poem is much shorter, much shorter than a story. A story is a full long essay, so that kind of thing, right? So a poem is just short. Okay, so poems are shorter. In writing skills and grammar, you focus a lot about evidence and your reasons and your examples to back to support what you're saying. And so there's a very specific organization to that. And we're learning in creative writing how you can still have that same sort of organization and be an effective writer, but in a, an imaginative way. And then I think in general we're learning about how to be creative, how to think outside the box. And it's a fun class. It's fun to, to talk about what you would do if you were invisible for a day. And it's fun to talk about you know, the very best day you've ever had in your whole entire life, or write, tell me about yourself from your cat's perspective. You know, it's, it's really fun to hear the things that these kids come up with because they never cease to amaze me how, how imaginative they are.